one. A little late, but you know what? That's okay. We're just going to swing with it. Yaksa, thank you so much for coming on live with Alicia Lowe. I know people are probably wondering who I am, but it's your girl, your nice, nice girl, Alicia Lowe. I am on Chatted Up Show that's on Energy Radio, and I also have my own show on Instagram, Live with Alicia Lowe. Yaksa, welcome. Welcome, man. Yeah, man. Thanks for having me today, you know? You're welcome. You're a bit busy, but you don't know. Make it happen. Yes, yes sir. And thank you so much. As usual, I let everybody know nothing is perfect. We're just doing our best. Um, so to start off, let us know why the name Yaksta. Well, Yaksta, um, it means mental stamina, you know. It was actually, uh, I used to have a, a name called Brainiac, you know, when, when I was younger, you know, but I just flipped it. The IAC after the word brainiac, to, you know, to YAK and at STA. So it means mental stamina, you know? Yeah. Okay, okay. So how long have you been doing music? I've been, I, I've been doing music from about six. But, you know, it, it's, it's actually something that, you know, I have from birth, you know. It's just like I capitalize on this um, whole journey. Like, but, you know, five years ago when I was 23, I started doing music professionally. But as long as I can remember, I've been doing music, you know. Music has I've been a thing for me. Okay. So it's kind of like your calling. Yeah, man, definitely. That's really good. So give us a little bit of your background, um, where you're from and your, your, your family. Well, I'm from a parish of St. Mary, you know, a, a little place called, you know, um, Port Maria. You know, grew up in a place called Glock Street, you know, a.k.a. You know, Cock Street. But in Jamaica, I don't know how oh, 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 we speak, you know. We put fire up and everything, you know, that so that a, a little bit smutty. But, you know, Cock Street, a.k.a. Glock Street. Um, went to Portmore Primary, went to Iron High School, you know, did some online studies. Never went to college, but just furthered my education via doing, you know, some online studies. Um, it's pretty much that. You know, I did um, entrepreneurship. And I don't look at him the same way. Um, work at a hotel like any normal smuddy. Mm -hmm. But yeah, yeah, it's basically a call for me. A humble upbringing. So what about your, your, your family? Was your family supportive of your um, getting into, you know, music? How were they? No, well, when a person just had a white picket fence and, you know, a uniform, that's what they see for their children, you know? A fireman, police, soldier, but that was not my calling. My calling was just music. And, you know, sadly... You know, we as the quote unquote, you know, ghetto people don't really say art as something um, ambitious. But mm -hmm. in these times, the narrative, you know, has and have been changing, you know. So um, back then, no, I wouldn't say the support was really much, but no, it's a little bit different because, you know, there's results. Yes. So they feel better now. So I was, that was my next question. So what are they saying to you now? What is your family? What are their words of encouragement that they have for you? Well, my mother, my mother is always about the money, you know. That, <laughs> my mother ambitious, you know. Yeah. Um, yeah, my father does support me the same way. You know, she's a, um, he, he's a person that always, you know, he believes in me the same way. Never really grew up with him, but, you know, we have a strong relationship since I've late, you know. So you don't know the thing, though. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. So um, the, the big hit big, big hit Ambition came out and it kind of stirred up the world, I would say. Um, because the first thing you started out with was, excuse me, the Pagans. So explain yeah. to people on here who are not Caribbean, West Indian, that don't understand what that means and what the song meant. Like, what did that mean for the song? No, Pagan is actually an English word, mate. It's in the Bible. It's biblical, I understand. Sometimes somebody said Pagans and Pharisees. You don't know if you check the scripture, but, you know, most, 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 I would, I would not say most, but, you know, a mass amount don't really, um, it's not really in tune to the Bible in these times, even though it's a good book. And it also have, you know, bad narrative, same way. You don't know, it's just, um, speaking of some bad mind, dirty hard people, we call them in Jamaica. Bad mind means something, a person that is very envious, or, you know, um, envious of somebody, jealousy, mm -hmm. anything that, um, in, in, you know, is in that vein. Of 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 extension, you know. In um in Jamaica, we just call them people. Some people don't want to see nobody rise and think the same way. But okay. yeah, it was actually directed not just to like a single, like a single handed um handed individual. It was more, it was more like in general, anybody who watch every black, the youth them from actually grow. 
come out of the way. Move. I would say the Lord apology. Come out of the oh. way. You know? Yes. Yeah. That was catching. That was very catching for the song. That's the first thing that got me. Because, you know, more times people navigate towards negativity more. Um, so that, for me, was like, I was like, wow, okay, I, I understand. So segueing into that, people trying to hold you down, how has, tell, give us a little bit about, like, rejection. Have you faced, like, any rejection starting out with your music? No, man, I, I, I face lessons. I wouldn't say as, I, I don't view them as rejection. Maybe back then, but no, not now. Because really and truly, you need a story. And every great wall, you know, comes from a foundation. The foundation get the martyr and the black. And before the martyr and black can lay, you need the mason. You understand? And you need somebody that has vision. So that's why you go to a person who can draw a plan. You know? Okay. So, you know, so it's a, 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 like an architect, you know? So for me, it was basically like a building process. And a career is like a building. What you put in is what you get out. So if continuously you're putting in the labor, eventually we get a building. The reward will come. So yes, I've got a lot. I'm gotten a lot of projections, but really and truly, was, that was just projection to show them that I can actually, you know, make something of I'm um, from nothing. Because in country there is not much um, possibilities here, but I saw lucrative um, loopholes, and I never stopped trying until the ball was through the hoop, you know. And I'm such I'm just more related. Because I see that possibility sometimes can start from a matches box, you know, and and and, and erupt in a volcano. So for me, it is much more than just a rejection. It's projection, aspiration that really and truly needs fuel. And when you get that spark, you just light it and it's elegant, like, like engulf it in a bigger fire. Yeah, blessings. So, so what makes you so positive, though? Because I, I see you, um, you know, on your Instagram, you're spreading the word about um, mainly like positivity. What made you so positive? Were you always this positive? No, you see, where, where there's a facade, there's a facade, you know. And that means, it, where, no, no. Let me rephrase that. Where there's a facade, there's shade. You see, if you're true to yourself, you'll be, just be true to you. Even though positivity is there, you still have a sense of aggression because remember, I am human being like anybody else. You know, I have split personality like anybody else, but real and truly, the anger is just when time it is being provoked. Real and truly, naturally, I am just an individual that is very jovial. From, ask anybody from going to school, from the musical Mikibi, you know? Okay. So for me, it's basically, if you if you just walk around with every, because, all right, when I look, even in America, everybody just walk loggy and vex with the world. So if me for join that, I'm not going to be an ex vex individual. Why have the light and out it and out it for the darkness? Remember how we have the light, you know. We are electro magnetical beings, you know. Mm. We have the gene there, you know, we have the light, we have, we have the source there, you know. But we as individuals tend to just dim the light the more time. And take on every problem of the world. You see, if you have your problem, I yeah, my friend, I'm gonna give you a solution, you come back with your problem, you go on, you know, be like me do next time I come. Nah, let you in. Sorry. And I'm my <laughs> problem. Me I stay with my happiness. You can't go out there. You, you can't go out your crosses. You know, and your headache. From once me, I give you some positive influences, and you keep coming around with the same thing. It's almost like a circumlocuting in a contract. You see the mm. you see the actual meaning there, and you still have go around it. You have beat you have beat the corner over and over and over and over again. So for me, it's just finding a, a peace of mind for me or solace. It is better than trying to find solitude. You understand? Because sometimes you might not get it. Yes, sir. Mm, very interesting. Where do you get your beliefs from? What you believe in? Because I hear no. you a lot talking about your, your energy and um, the things that you believe. Where does that come from? Are you, are you a Rasta? And this is a question that DM me and ask me. Like, are you a Rasta? Do you practice um, the religion? Like, where do your beliefs come from? Well, I, 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 I couldn't. I, I would not say I'm a Rasta. Mm -hmm. You understand? But I got I've gotten teachings. My friends like Gideon and Tough like Iron and Micah Shamaya and Goldie and all them the ones and ones that who you know they're around me. But real and truly, I don't really believe in that much things. Me just know what feel right to me, I just dig with the wave. Because real and truly, if you because remember nothing that you know is accurate. It's someone else's interpretation. And I've searched every single thing is inaccurate. It is just accurate to your understanding or your belief or your like. So we've got the word belief in the same sentence. So I've searched 
what feels good to me, I jig with. So real and truly, you know the right. Because if, for instance, if you if you with somebody and you bond them, or even cheat on them, you go know, and them yeah. and them go know. In time, certain things start change, and as such, you feel it. The energy tell you. When 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 somebody punch you in the face, you feel it. So real and truly, I've worked with energy, not belief. Because belief is limited. It is one mindset that is projected to another, or passed on to another. So for me, me nobody work with the belief. Me just work with what women feel is right. Because I believe sometimes it's just not accurate. And, here, and inaccuracy can never give you corrections because it is inaccurate. Yes, sir. Wow. So how does that transfer over into your music? Well, your energy. How does that transfer over into your music? I ask you, you know, because I remember you know, when I come to your life, you have beat ambition. So it transfer, you understand? Remember, you don't, you don't play the song, you know, I see the song is going already. You have beat the song across the world. So me just have be myself. You see, all right, you see, if I build a tune, I'm in the boat. And me can't catch a key. Me just show thoughts up me now. Is anything feel right to let me work with it? Make my hand tell you. Take off all my boot more time, you know, and take off all my shot. Anything, anything that me feel right to let me work with it, I swear. Yeah. Wow, that's different. I've never heard that before. You're the first artist that I've ever heard, you know, kind of give me an inside look into, like, how you are as far as your music. Someone said that you're very intelligent, and I see that. But you said that you didn't go to college. No. So, um, I'm sorry. I'm just reading. So, what I wanted to get at with that question is, how did you become so humble? Was it because, because I've heard other songs from you. I've, I've looked you up, and I've heard other songs. I kind of feel like you had a different sound before. You know, your all right. Then, you know, actually, the world just got to know Yaksta through ambition. But really and truly, I've always been this way. Oh. It's like music is art, and I've, and, and, and I've such and as an artist, you have to stamp your signature in any single thing you do. We can still sing the same bad man, we can still sing the same ranchy raw, but I will not be adding to society in a positive way. You understand? We can get up and sing a back of gun lyrics. Me have, a, me have books up and books. We have books here in my cabinet. We have peer gunman tune. I have raw song when I tell women to do the all, um, the world and the most. Yeah. But I just realize it. If I'm doing the same thing, because real and truly, you know, when I destroy a generation, you know, for them generation who come after them in a real and truly, they are demented. My generation, they mad. We, we come from a mad generation. So all that we can go out mad. We have to try to fix somebody when they come after. Because if you look on it, we used to have marble and we used to play with dolls and, 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 and ties and action figures and all that thing there as a youth. Them youth are work with tablet. Poops, blue movie. Poops and bad man show. Gun game. You know, so them they really get to un actually understand what it means to live outside. It is much more virtual and as such, them disconnected with actual nature. You know, so for, so for me, real and truly is not, say, boy, intelligence is not in the book, you know. Intelligence is, is what you experience. Experience is intelligent. It, it is intelligence. A man may not can read literary, um, um, with, are inclined to literacy. But his skills of intelligence can even teach a man who can read. Remember, you know, the person who runs an organization or a corporation, you know, the whole thing, him have the intelligence to control. But real and truly, if you forgive him the logistics and say, all right, read this, him don't know one fact, that's when he get a liar and then get somebody who has the skill set for that job. But because you're given a position with a certain amount of liquid, you get comfortable and have such a, you become complacent. So comfort me to work with. That's why if me are going to want the smallest bed, so I keep on dreaming big. I don't want a big Benz and drive. I don't want to just start out and have a big Benz. It's almost like I accomplish every single thing with a poor man or, 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 or the, the poor man starter pack. You know? A hotel, mm -hmm. a weekend pass with a shorty, you have a Benz that I do, you have an NSA bottle. I don't want that. I walk with my local water. I'm going to buy my bag juice and them something. I'm going to cook my dumping down at the same yard. So when you still have the same mindset as I get to youth, you get to widen your horizon. Never get too comfortable or complacent because real and truly. The most I said to you, you know, in the good book. He said, he will give you what you want in abundance. He never said, limitation, you know, abundance being plenty, you know. That is mm -hmm. limited. So if you limit yourself out of your abundance, that, that simply means you're just in a box or in a scoop then. You have to actually try to access that abundance and as such, abundance is infinite. So you don't know. Yeah, man, we don't want this poor man start a pack, man. No. Who are <laughs> yeah, who are for nowhere? What a man who, 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 who own Amazon name? 
um, Shined man there. Yeah. Okay. We have a whole paper playing them and it's them. Yeah. What's your name? What's your name? I, I have no idea. I don't even remember. Steve Jobs. Steve, Steve Jobs are where I want for him. Yeah, Steve Jobs. I want to know the book where I read. Yeah, man. I want to know the soup where I drink the same way. And, oh. and, and even such, that is just materialism. Yeah. Abundance is still inclined to nature itself. So when time you can tap into all four corners and understand what it is, then as such, you will know what you are. Because human beings are incomplete because they still not get them full potential. So until you access that amount of knowledge, you're limited, my darling. Yes, I. Wow. Okay. I really respect that. Um, I see a change for Jamaica. Um, are you taking up that responsibility of changing Jamaica and the way that they see the music? Um, considering that there's so much crime right now, do you feel like you can be a role model for change? I can be a role model to the children. Okay. You understand? Me can't change Jamaica. Because Jamaica is a mindset. It's an island with people that has a mindset and a skill set. And as such, where there's survival, there's violence. So I cannot change Jamaica. Jamaica will change itself. But I can add my two cents in trying to show a different narrative. You understand? Maybe we can change a few minds, but I cannot change Jamaica. If the parents are can't do it, me can't do it. Bob Marley try. The Greeks yeah. them try. Michael Jackson try them dead. So that is whole heap of, of work for the clerks alone. We need you and everybody upon the live and them family and them friends and them friends and them friends and them friends to change Jamaica. Me alone can't do it, mama. I don't worry if I really feel like But I'm not going to dead by now. I swear. Yeah. Yes, totally understand. I understand. So let us know. Um, your music, like I said, is changing the world. Let us know if you have any collaborations coming out soon with anybody. Give us a little inside secret on the music that you're working on. Just look for Falco, a.k.a. Assets. You oh. understand? Yeah, man. Ambition is banging in. You know? But you have the Falco coming in right now. You know, it's booming in. Yeah, man. Yeah. So very soon, look out for your EP, same way. What about collaborations, both local and international, major labels, and you don't know my label with music alongside um, Sanjay and Igos and, you know, Quasi from Afrobeat, and you have Mal and Easy from um, um, from Just Easy Production, and you have um, some other individuals that we're working with, like Runner Beats, etc. But Yaksa is always working. You know, I'm Attila, so I've searched you, you reap. Mm. But... I am much more grateful to the people of Jamaica for who actually take the time out for listening to Sang Ambition and put it forward. Because really and truly, the power is in the people. That's why yeah. you can't hype on them. If you have so much ego, if you take a picture with an individual who is fascinated with you because you gave them something to mm. actually look forward to and you shown them, that means uh, you actually uh, kill your own seeds where you plant them. It's basically you'll be a light to yourself. So I can't tell the rest of why I'm going to try to help everybody. And we can't, so we can't please everybody because that is impossible because people have them, them own personal preference. But I try to do what I can do to the best of my ability. You know, what woman does not meet, I'm just so sorry, but give me a little time to try again. You know, I just saw it go. Yeah. Mama, I can't, I don't have time to pretend and put on, you know, I don't have time for that. That's too much work. I just have been mean, and that is me. So, I'm a youth, I move park, I can't walk down the road, go buy from the same people. I used to buy color food from my men and sit down and chat, see them, you know, I change. You understand? Because that is where my inspiration comes from. I open the bush, I go up and I go and go to you, I lay down at night, I eat my popcorn, I eat my peanut them, I look at melon, I look at color food, I stew them sometimes, I go and juice, I just have a vibe. By myself, I chat to my tree, I chat to myself, because I'm going to stay. Yeah. You got go out a bush. Like, you're, re you're really in the bush? I live in the bush. Is I'm the bush lad. Yeah, man, literally. I'm the bush lad, but I kind of felt, I thought that that was like a. A man, a, a slang? No, yeah. man. Character. Remember, I know. Remember, I know. All right. You have Yaksta. You have Yaksta Caravani. Yeah. You have Kemal Martin. You know? You have Bush and you have Bush Lad and you have Waklax Comb. So there's so many personalities. But really and truly, in music, there's Bush Lad and there's Yaksta. And as such, what you see is what you get. Bush Lad is just, it just means I like inclined to nature them. Let me put it in a shorter term. Because what clocks come, it's like a bung, but to bush means where, where there's water and flotation, you know? Mm. Things shall grow. Because if you throw water upon the ground, we shall see it plant. That is flotation. Things have to bear from it. You understand? But we don't take the time out to learn our own black language then. You understand? Every single thing is just washed. Yeah. And we don't know the actual origin. So you have to learn where you come from. And I've just been trying to learn. And not the best at it. But I'm learning. So one time, if a man 
text and just like what a person uh, um just directly you know the um what do you think called the comment thing down at the, down at the bottom of the live where I talk about the person who own Amazon big them up to see him because me never know him name honestly never know him name but I know the man who, 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 who run Amazon so big up my fans them because them are correct me in the side and me and them are work anything with them say that I work with you know yeah, yeah. love my fans them you know, because my fans them love me you know. wow Put some bush emoji on us. I'm sure my fans are loving. Put some bush emoji on the bottom. Don't, no, don't have the, the comment part. Why for the bottom? Don't have the comment part. Yeah. Live, share the live because I'm learning. As you're yeah. speaking, I am learning a lot because a lot of these things I don't know myself. Um, so knowledge is key, and I encourage everybody to get knowledgeable. Um, what about unity and dance hall? We're waiting for the bush guys. <laughs> There's all different kinds. All yeah. different. <laughs> so I don't want to keep you all night I know you're very busy because you know you have a million things going on but yeah, man. give me a little bit about unity and dance hall are you are you one that is trying to push unity in dance hall reggae um, in, in Jamaica the, the artist in general give me a little bit about that you see, ego is a hell of a thing when it comes down to a space of people that really and truly have talent because people try to compete. And where there's competitor, there will be likes and dislikes and comments. And as such, it might translate into our transcending something much more bigger than just music. So really and truly, to start a, unifi a unified dance hall, we first have to stop view each other's competition and try to learn from each other. If I can sing better than you, try to find a better verse than, than my melody. If mm. I have more melody than you, try to find a better melody than mine. But don't compete. Just try to find something that stands out. If I wear a glass boot, make your own out a ply board. And if I fly a plane, fly a truck. That is impossible, but, imp but, but we, are, we have seen impossible. Man yeah. make phone to me, you can't talk. No, you, you, they, we are way, way. I made a chucker. And me, I talk on the phone, viewing everything. You understand? And, and we never understand what, what, what I just said a while ago. <laughs> but I can actually translate it in English. You're so far away, but yeah. I'm here. And we're actually conversing. So as such, until we as artists stop trying to differentiate the music into our own personal beliefs and use our ego to keep it aside or divided, we will never have a dance hall that is unified. Because at first, when a youth arise, instead of them push the youth up further, them try to tear it down. Yeah. Not saying me, no. But that's what I've been seeing. Like people are threatened by other artists' talent. And that's why I've been just segregated. Because everybody wants to be the man. Mm -hmm. But we can be one, but everybody wants to be the man. The one that is always in the man. Because it's all about me, not the we. So you see, the me concept has to be eradicated. And until that is gone, you will always find the dog mind dance hall. That is called bad mind. Segregation. Fight against. The same old narrative. And that is just a, and, 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 and a reality. Ego is the biggest gun. It shoots you so far when you're so near that you can't even realize that you're deteriorating as a carcass that is living. Wow. It's like a bullet that kills your soul very slowly. And that's the reason why I have some people that rise up on a pinnacle and drop on a plateau and go right under the cross to the core, past, past the mantle, and burn out in ash. Because mm -hmm. real and truly, they must pray for themselves. You can't pray for yourself. I help who I can help, who I can help the sub boy. Cuss me, just take on the cuss and walk away. That's God living. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Well, that is very humbling, and um, I hope that you know dance hall and reggae can unite. And I'm I'm anxious to hear more of your songs and see. Um, are you working on music videos right now for any of these? Yeah, man. Every day, man. As I say, music is my drug, you know. That is my bad habit. You see, if I should be spending foolishly, that would be on music and real and truly because it is art. It will transcend back into kinds. Anyone may take it. Whether by streams or by hard copy or by purchase, it is still an investment. So as such, I'd rather invest in something that is influential and infectious to someone's soul that into something that eats away mine. Because yeah. remember, we have the weekdays and then the weekend. The weekend when you're weekend and the weekdays is the day when you're weekend and then on the weekend you drink booze that eats away your soul and the whole embodiment in your flesh. Because you consume spirit from a battle. You know? So I'd rather sing some revit um, revitalizing whiskey for the people I and mean, that is music. Because music is the biggest rum, you know. And when you take, and when, and, and when you take a, a sip of that, you know, hit you, you feel no pain. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you that word, you know. I like yeah. that, let me not tell you that. Yeah, man. 
That's it, go on. Rise up. So give us some words of encouragement for the younger artists out there who are trying to get their music out and heard by the world like you. Stop call selector. The selector not play a song and find it tune. You understand? Spend some time, forgot proper studio and put out proper quality. Present yourself like a business and people will take you serious. True. And it's load the rum cup them out of the army thing them and open back a ganja script on the stage show them and the bag of man back here. Yeah. I know. Yeah. I, I, yeah. I, Nextly, like really next put a belt in your pants and put it up on your waist. Button your shirt properly. Mm. Yeah. You can't cause bad words because that is Jamaican culture. That is a part of we. Yeah. You know? Stop disrespecting the woman then. Secondly, no. yes. yeah, man. you know, Number. take time out, yeah, and say whenever you feel like you go crash or give up, go harder. It simply means say, you reach a hurdle that you don't need to cross. I've learned it the hard way. So, me can tell you personally, if you want to go corporate, present yourself as a corporate entity. Mm. If you want to get respected, be respectful. If you want to go further, push further, put in more work. Read, expand your horizon. Load the bag of liquor. Intoxication is not performance. That is not art. That is disgust. True. And I've searched your past and the same thing to the youth, they more foul to you. Because they more feel like that is the in thing. A gun now, video starts slanging. And, and, and next thing too, we basically have to start teaching with black people in black culture. Learn about what you are. We're not Jews. We're not Hindu, we are Africans. And as such, we have to actually stick, stick in our rhythm. And that is nothing racial. It is just something that our community have to know. Because real and truly, if you pass on this knowledge to the youth, then you have to just make them know the truth and the fact. Mm -hmm. And just take out this, take out the segregation from out of your mind. No matter which race, no matter where a man comes to you with, you just mm -hmm. know it's a human being and human beings are flawed. And as such, you have to work in accordance to them. Teach them, when, teach them what you know that is positive. Try to impact them positively. Mm -hmm. You understand? Don't afraid to speak your mind. As long as you're not being disrespectful. Be true to you. And have such a courage to walk with you anywhere you go. That is just life. Yes, sir. I can listen to you all day. Because I'm, I'm learning myself. And I know a lot of people on the live right now are saying the same thing. Very intelligent. Very humble. Let us know where we can find your music. Where we can purchase your music. Where we, your fans can support you. All right. So tomorrow I'm going to go up on the radio. It's the evidence. Everything where they say. Go and say, go buy Yaxta Music and uh, Apple. Go buy Yaxta Music and Amazon. Go stream Yaxta Music on YouTube. It's official Yaxta. And remember, so when the merch come, you're going to make sure DM you and make you tell all your friends at www.yaxtamusic.com. Support the youth, the youth them so we can support you. Know, so, same way. Merch, Love and light. Hats? Are you going to have the hats, the glasses? What, what are you doing? You, you, you like, like normal as a home girl. Girl, I got her <laughs> tongue. Bad <laughs> suit. You, have it? <laughs> you didn't know how I go on. We got all that good something over here, so. We have our foundation and, and, and makeup. We have venture having that to see me. Call one, you know? Do you have yeah. size? Do you I have size? Because I'm plus size. Plus size? Plus size clothing. No, man. In Jamaica, we call it the right fit. We have the right fit, them baby body, man. We are talking about this plus size. Yeah? You have battery? A battery alone have plus, plus size, man. You know, you have battery. You have battery. battery. Yeah? Oh, we are good with that. You are the right fit, mama. Yeah. Right. Thank you. On top of being very yeah. hilarious, you're funny. Like I said, I could listen to you all night. Thank you so much for coming on. We had Love some life. earlier, but guess what? We made it happen. Um, and yeah. yes, guys, of course, follow your girl for more great interviews. Yaksta, thank you. Thank you so much. And you have a great night. You too, man. Blessings. All right. All right. Yeah. I'm done, cook. <laughs> yeah, I did it. It ain't open. I'll make up my same thing. I know.